Welcome back to Right Direction YouTube channel. I think everybody is fine. Today we will talk about something important that is to know how to manage a language club. You know, it's a very important task for the students. It's a matter of so that the today's students don't think for that. So they are just trying to get themselves admitted in a higher, uh, in a renowned college or university. And that's the matter of uh, regret there. So, you know, the many students uh, getting a highly certificate or being a highly uh, qualified students don't know how to speak English quickly. You know, still now, many teachers of these days of schools and colleges, even they don't know how to speak English. And that is why they are taking class on in their mother tongue, that means in Bangla, using Bangla language. I, I, I'm, I'm not uh, in a negative side of using Bangla in the class. But you have to be smart, updated, you know. In India or Sri Lanka, in other neighboring countries, they are English teachers are using English language on the classroom, but we don't. Yeah, yeah, they, they, they have some problems, but we have to be uh, much more careful about maintaining a language club. It's a must needed for all the students. But, you know, English learners are not much more interested in making English club. But for what of they don't have... Uh, much more time they are just running after to get a uh, GPA 5 or to get a uh, good certificates uh, to be a good student but you know how to speak English uh, yeah you have to know how to speak English and you have to be much more conscious using this language internationally also uh, today I will talk about how to maintain a language club how to establish a language club or how to carry on this direct language club yeah so you, you need to follow some steps some uh, method and techniques and I, will, I would like to talk about uh, methodology and techniques what you need and for that's making your club successful so today mm, I'm gonna talk about uh, important parts of uh, language club important methods and uh, roles and regulation to manage a language club firstly that's so you need a permanent room and you need some permanent members who will uh, carry out the responsibilities and first of all you have to be uh, much more careful about the timing you know that you should have a fixed time to be gathered around yourself and uh, you yeah you the same classes maybe and uh, may not be this is not a uh, problem at all you know uh, class 9 10 11 12 or uh, even class 6 7 any t any type of students any type of learners can be gathered around in a fixed place or any job seekers and uh, job uh, makers or any kind of who are running and, and have a job so that's that's not problem and uh, abroad goers and uh, even, even the workers the levels everybody can be gathered in a fixed place to make themselves around uh, the perfect in speaking english so i think yeah that's uh, gonna be a fantastic time for you incredible methods i'm going to give you and you know it's a it's an interesting time with you and uh, it's it's uh, it will be a fantastic uh, memory for for now how to manage a language club that's uh, so i would like to uh, uh, clarify how to uh, create it you know firstly yeah I talked about it the most, most important person there's a presenter you need to uh, be you need to have a moderator or a president of the club uh, yeah it will be highly certified oh no, so it it's can be uh, your principal it can be headmaster head teacher or your English teacher or your uh, uh, big persons or elder person in, in, in locality from your society you can take it or university student college students they can be a moderator or a president of the club yeah and then you need to have a presenter who will uh, run the club who will uh, present the program who will uh, monitor the program who will uh, carry out the, all the responsibilities and then you will have you'll need some fixed members 11 12 14 15 20 how much you can you how much uh, how many members you can uh, gather and uh, that's that's will be as much as possible you can gather you try to gather uh, most more people um, and many people you know whatever uh, more people uh, uh, arrange uh, together or gather together the knowledge uh, will be enhanced because you know a lot gather uh, by sharing knowledge is another part of knowledge uh, getting knowledge and, and that's that's the way what I want to mean to you so uh, then you need to follow some steps uh, some uh, methodology to carry out your responsibility firstly uh, in the morning you can arrange or in the afternoon and the presenter will come to the dais and uh, introduce himself and then like that I'm, I'm, I'm okay suppose I am a presenter of a 
English uh, language club. Okay. First now I am uh, just coming to my uh, platform uh, in front of the dais and I will introduce myself. Okay. Hello dears. I am uh, Shujat Khan talking, uh, inviting you to start our to this lesson to this Dani uh, in English language club. I would like to uh, uh, introduce myself. This is Shujat Khan, um, presenter of this uh, language club. I am a teacher. Uh, yeah, this is my profession. I would like to go uh, as early as possible to my school and uh, you know, I am very punctual at my uh, time and I would like to help the students. I, I always monitor my class. Yeah, from uh, morning to till uh, evening, I have to work a lot, you know, a teacher is a full life student. I have to be updated on my uh, lesson, syllabus, question paper, you know, and all the students to follow me, I have to be a model for the student. That's why I would like to be a student first, you know, and uh, I would like to uh, get there the good student with the very one and I would like to monitor uh, taking the group wars, um, some uh, extra curricular activities or making some students engaged in participating activities. Yeah, I, I would like to follow the rules and regulation given by the government, authority in power, a school committee. Yeah, that's I have a wonderful environment, wonderful school. I have a lovely student, a lot of lovely students, lovely uh, colleagues, and uh, with a uh, beautiful, uh, uh, with a beautiful environment, background, everything. You know, yeah, I'm very happy with my family as well. Well, that's the way I have maintained all the days and maintaining today and uh, that's the why everything what I want to uh, say to you. Uh, thank you very much. This is my turn and uh, everybody will uh, speak out about his uh, activities, his uh, daily routine. Suppose somebody may be doctor, he will just talk about his activities, his service. Somebody may be nurse, somebody may be businessman, uh, someone may be students, maybe uh, abroad goers, maybe job seekers. Any very in any profession can be uh, talked here to run the language club and then you have to be at, uh, much more concerned using the second step. The second step is to talk about uh, informative information or that's called uh, you have to give some information in a fixed topics. Okay. There will be a fixed topic for everybody. Okay. Suppose uh, you may give the international mother language day for Bangladesh, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody will come to standards and they will talk about like that. Okay. Suppose this is my topic for me and I'll, I'll talk about like that. Yeah. But thank you very much. Uh, uh, good afternoon. Or I'll say good morning to everybody. How are you? Everybody will say, yeah, I am fine. Thank you very much. And then so you will give the uh, thanks to the presenter like that me. Yeah. Thanks. To, uh, thanks. Uh, lovely. Thanks for me. Uh, thanks to the presenter for giving me the nice chance to say something about uh, international mother language. I would like to talk about this, how much I can. Yeah, it's a, yeah, a lovely thanks to the presenter, lovely thanks to the uh, moderator and the president of the function. Yeah, how much I can. Yeah, I would talk about uh, Dhaka University. Some students of Dhaka University fought for the language movement, in a language movement fought for their uh, mother tongue to be recognized. You know, Salam Borko Trophic Job or so one have uh, sacrificed their life for only mother in Bangla. Yeah, yeah, this, uh, this, it's a matter of sorrow. But yeah, it's, uh, it will be surprised to hear that this Shohid Dibos has been uh, declared as an international mother language throughout the world. Yeah, it's a lovely news. It's a great news for you. And uh, uh, everybody should uh, uh, respect the martyrs and everybody should respect uh, uh, their mother tongue and should be much more conscious uh, protecting their mother tongue to be, uh, uh, to be uh, mixed on with the the language and yeah yeah that's how thank you very much i would like to terminate my speech uh, yeah again would like to thank to the presenter uh, moderator president all the presenter all the viewers here and thank you lovely guys okay welcome and that's the way you can mm, explain your ideas your thoughts your emotion what you wanna say what i mean wanna uh, clear to the viewers to the all uh, listeners that's the way yeah yeah first you can make yourself uh, yeah you feel nervous yeah mm, suppose okay you can be a uh, little bit nervous your hands will be trembling with the flowers you will you'll be uh, a lot of yeah what yeah yeah thank you yeah 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 <laughs> okay thank you yeah that's the way you will feel yourself uh, very nervous okay no, don't worry don't worry you'll be uh, you'll be okay for waiting a few days uh, two three or five days and then yeah you carry on just responsibilities yeah there's a huge tax you know uh, gathering knowledge sharing knowledge is a very very good tax and almighty allah he loves him who broadcast knowledge among the students okay yeah my request to every teacher please arrange a 
language club in your schools whatever you stay wherever you walk and every students please uh please humble request uh yeah start to speak english just try to speak english with your younger brothers elder brothers family members sisters whatever you have and who are they not in fact but yeah you have to speak english uh, that's the point uh, that's the um, that's the way what i want to show you and uh, that's the point what i want to mean to you and uh, yeah thank you very much again uh, yeah yeah mm, a lovely f yeah wow yeah it's a sunny day a very uh, f funny day and a lovely environment lovely uh, around a natural a uh, natural environment yeah yeah this is my garden <laughs> my vegetable garden yeah mm. okay thank you very much uh, see you next hi goodbye